Hi, Jenny from Spot a Home Dublin here and today we're going to be looking at a really spacious two bedroom apartment right in Dublin city centre. So we're located just off the Grand Canal here. It's a really lovely spot. You've really got the best of both worlds here. It's it's the business district of, of Dublin city. So you've got a lot of employers in the vicinity here, which makes it a very convenient spot. The other great side about that is it means that uh, evenings and weekends, it's actually nice and quiet. So for residents, it's a lovely, peaceful area to live. But you're right in the city centre. You're only maybe 20 minutes walk from Grafton Street and you've got a, a great choice of shops, restaurants and cafes right on your doorstep. Another great advantage here is that being on the Grand Canal, there's lovely walks along the canal lots of greenery so it's got a really lovely feel you can kind of escape the the urban center feel uh, right on your doorstep again you've got great public transport options here so there are numerous buses that run along Baggett Street and the other main arteries around us and you've also on the Dart line so the Dart is the frequent train service for Dublin that runs along Dublin's coastline and you're about a five minute walk from Grand Canal Dock Dart station here so really it's got everything going for it in this location and the apartment itself is modern and comfortable so really nice we'll have a walk through it now. So we're starting here in the entrance hall. It's a really wide, spacious entrance hall. Uh, the first thing we have here over to our left is a storage cupboard oh, directly inside the door and that has a hanging rail in it and other storage space. And there's a chest of drawers set directly beside us here. Again, plenty of storage in this. One's a bit full. There's a mirror here on the wall and all of the rooms then radiate off this central hallway. So we will start, we'll work our way around this way and we'll start by having a quick look in the bathroom. So a nice modern bathroom, three mirrors set on the wall, a shelf there and the WC and washer and basin are built into the wall. Behind us is a bathtub. There is a folding shower door on it. Let me just pull it out. So that it moves very nice and smoothly. Back in. There is a shower attachment then over the bath. So that runs off the main water tank. There's a heated towel rail here on the wall behind us then. That's one last look across the bathroom. And then we'll continue into the main living space. So there's an opening here off the main living space that brings us into the kitchen. So fully fitted kitchen. Firstly, we have washing machine, which is a washer and dryer. There's a stainless steel sink unit with a drainer on it. Underneath that, we have a storage of cleaning products. There is dishwasher here. Um, that is a, is, this one doesn't open, but in beside us then we have our fridge. So there's a bit of storage in that fridge and an ice box as well. Next we have a set of drawers, so there's cutlery there. And pots and pans underneath. There is a corner press here, which houses more pans and cookware. And lastly, over on this side, storage drawers. So these are set underneath the oven. You can see double oven. This section has a grill in it. And this is the main oven section. And we've got a couple more storage presses over it. Um, I'm afraid I'll have to leave that one. It's a bit too high for me. Uh, we'll have a look at the counters now. So there's our microwave in the corner. We have a four ring electric hob. And there is more cookware there in the corners. Uh, there are wall level presses also. So we've got space for food storage. Um, more storage there. This 
is also clear. Uh, extractor fan there over the hob. There's absolutely mountains of storage in this kitchen. So you could definitely do a big supermarket shop and have plenty of space to stockpile. So there are cups and glasses there. More crockery bowls there. And a few more crockery pieces. Right, so said so really well equipped kitchen with plenty of storage. There is a little um an, an extra store here beside us. So it houses the boiler and uh, a little bit of space for cleaning products, etc. Now to look out at the main living space, as you can see, this is a great, really large area. It's a lovely space. So first we have dining table here, round dining table with four chairs. There is a lamp over this. Artwork on the walls. And then the seating area. Got a big corner sofa. Lovely wooden coffee table. TV in the corner. Over here, there is actually a fireplace. It's a lovely feature to have in an apartment, nice focal point. And there is actually a little balcony here as well. Oh, so figure this out. We lift it right up and it opens. And you can step out onto just a small balcony space overlooking the street. Now, there are two bedrooms, so we'll go and have a look at those now. We'll look at the smaller of the two first. So this is bedroom number two. It is a double bed, double bedroom. There is a bedside locker here in this corner. Looks out again over to the street. And there is a wardrobe here on this wall. So storage, shelving within the wardrobe and hanging rails. That's bedroom two. And to have a look at it, bedroom one is an ensuite. So you come into almost like a little lobby area in this bedroom, and this is where the wardrobes are. So sliding wardrobe door gives you all this storage space. And there's more space along here. There is also a built in store. In behind us. Oh, it's, it's a little dark there. Let me just pop on an extra light. So there we go. This is perfect for housing, Hoover, etc. There is an ensuite bathroom. So the first thing we'll look at this a uh, is there a WC. There's a heated towel rail. Let's, let's move this. And a shower. With a sliding shower door and electric shower, electric mirror shower, fully tiled there. On this corner, then we have a mirror over a wash hand basin, which has storage in this press underneath it. There are also the storage baskets mounted on the wall. We need to look back at the bedroom itself. from the lobby and this is the bedroom so really good size double bedroom chest of drawers here bedside table bedside table there we're looking out over the same streetscape and there's also a an armchair in that corner there So that is bedroom one, and that concludes the tour of the apartment. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any queries, you can contact us at spotahome.com.